Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to Ask NK. Today we're taking a look at an amazing add-on known as City Builder 3D. City Builder 3D is an add-on that is for anyone who is trying to build cities, maybe you're into VFX or you're trying to do some explosions of buildings, or probably you just want to create cityscape then you should definitely consider this one. This tool is made available by the guys at Light Architect and of course they do have a truckload of amazing, amazing stuff. I'm gonna put a link in the description so you can check these things out. Now the City Builder actually comes with 40 professional 3D assets all packed into a very user-friendly you know, uh, UI. So just in case you wanna work with this, you definitely will find some sort of comfort getting clean, high quality, detailed, and also, textured 3d model so you don't have to go through all of those hassles of creating the models yourself uving them texturing them all of those things are done for you all you need to do is just click and create buildings this add-on comes with three different categories of assets one is the metropolitan they also have the derelict future and then the cyberpunk clean future now all of these things are amazing but something else that is even way more amazing is once you purchase this tool you would also be able to have access to the cinematic movement rig that is coming for free so without further ado let's simply take a look at this amazing add-on and see what it does so with blender open what we have here is our default blender and in case you want to get this thing installed all you need to go do is go over to edit go over to preference and with preference open simply go over to add-ons install the add-on and then you're good to go now with the add-on installed once you press n on your keyboard you'll notice that we have it right here as city builder 3d now one thing to keep in mind is these assets are high quality so are their textures and also are their you know shading so it's you know one thing to keep in mind these are very high quality stuff so just in case you need them for your set dressing yeah you're gonna find them very useful so it's also worth mentioning that these things are being separated into the three categories that they have so you can see them here as metropolitan the sci-fi future and also the derelict future so deleting that cube i can go over to the metropolitan and you also notice that it's still divided into three we have the small buildings the mid-sized buildings which are the medium buildings and also the large ones so if you click right here you will be able to get a small building and of course we can just jump over to eevee and preview this and you can see the textures right here let's go ahead and change this light to not sun, not that. Okay, maybe something like this. This looks better. So we can get something like that. Let's also throw in a very nice looking grid. So we have that grid right there. We love our grid. You know, it gives us a sense of balance. Cool. So with this here, we can also select this and move the building over to this section. Let's actually put this a little bit behind. And you also notice we have the mid-size ones. So if I click right here, I also have a mid-size building that would just simply appear. Now within this mid-size building, you have one, two, three, four, and five. Same goes for the small and also the same thing goes for the large ones. And of course you can take a look at the textures. You can see how high these textures are. If you want to change them, you can simply switch from here go over to the shading and play with the shading network for these beautiful models so the same high quality stuff that you have here for the mid size and also the medium ones is exactly the same thing that you'll get if you take a look at the large one so if we simply take a look at a large looking stuff you can see by default that we have this large looking you know building set that we can throw into uh backgrounds and see some very lovely stuff happening and of course we can go ahead and explore some other ones the sci-fi looks pretty nice so if you also want to see some sci-fi stuff you can click the clean future small building this comes with even way more textures and also shading settings so you can also see these ones here and by the way we're previewing this using ev if you want to preview this using cycles i would suggest you turn on the noise in so you can get the most out of it and right now we don't even have a screen space reflection turned on so that's why you don't necessarily see a lot of things going through the glasses so this is also very very nice let's also take a look at something even way more bigger than what we have right there so these buildings right here are here for your useful pleasure so if you're thinking about working with high resolution buildings you want to work with heavier stuff 
stuff like this you can directly come over here take a look at some of these buildings the derelicts take a look at the metropolitan and also the sci-fi looking buildings and of course there is a wide range of stuff that you can get from this particular place you can go through and play with them but before we go let's take a look at some derelicts and i will simply get the derelict tree Ooh, this doesn't look bad this looks pretty decent let's change how we get to see our stuff right here i'm going to switch these over to cavity so we can get that there you know we can also choose to play with what we have so let's also change this you know right now we don't want to go in and start loading those textures so you can see looks nice okay we can also take a look at some other one so let's get a medium one Ooh, this also looks pretty pretty cool and the shading itself would look even way better and of course we can go through and also take a look at something like this so if you're looking forward to working with amazing looking buildings like this or maybe you just want something that you can throw into your scene that has a whole lot of air conditioning units and you don't want to stress yourself about modeling this stuff you just need something in the background or something to destroy then this tool is definitely going to be for you and of course like i said earlier once you download this particular add-on you will have access to a brand new add-on there is also another add-on right here which is the cinematic movement rig and this is included for free so once you pay for this particular add-on you're going to get this one for free and this is in case you need a rig now speaking about rig the guys from life architect also have a whole lot of other things if you want to check most of the things that they have right here they have rigs like light rigs they also have camera rigs they have tons and tons of other stuff interestingly enough if you're also looking for ways that you can get some of these things maybe you want to get the chaos and at the same time you want to get the city builder and maybe you want to get the camera rig okay you can actually purchase the bundle now the whole idea for the bundle is to save you cost so that you can get everything in one place and getting everything in one place means you're getting the cable cam rig you're getting the light rig you're getting the chaos system you're getting you know the city builder all for a very you know subsidized price contrary to purchasing these things individually so it's also very interesting to note that they have a very good rating and they are also you know at developer funders so in case you're feeling lucky or you're feeling excited about these things simply go over to the link in the description where you can purchase this and get working so tell me what you guys think about this in the comment section and of course if you like this video or you learned something from this you can go ahead and give it a like and don't forget to share with a friend and if you're new here it's going to be amazing for you to hit the subscribe button and also turn on the notifications so that you don't miss the next video or the next update and until i see you guys again with a tutorial update free friday tutorial tuesday tips and tricks things like this peace